Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to buy WizJet plane tickets online in 2023. WizJet is a popular Canadian airline known for its extensive domestic and international flight option. Whether you're planning a family vacation or a business trip, booking your WizJet tickets online is a quick and convenient uh, way. So in this step-by-step -step guide, I'll show you how to do it. So make sure to stick by and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll have to go and visit the WizJet website. To do so, we'll have to go and open whatever browser we're going to use to follow the tutorial steps with. Here in my case, of course, I'm going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you can use any other browser that you could possibly have or whatever browser, uh, browser you want. If you have like many browsers, whatever browser you prefer. Once you do so, go to the URL section, simply type wistjets.com and hit the enter button. That should take you to the home screen or main screen of WestJets website right away. If you have an account, make sure to go and log in into it by clicking on sign in, as you can see. And if you don't have an account, you can simply create a WizJet uh, Rewards account. Of course, creating an account will benefit you a lot. It will get for you points, uh, if, especially if you're traveling a lot. Those points can be can be used to reduce the plane tickets uh, price on future travels or get some add-ons for free, get some gift cards, depending on whatever you want. And of course, uh, if you don't know much about this widget, you can scroll down, read the more information about it, see like the reviews of people on this airline to be uh, secured and comfort about what you're getting or where uh, flights uh, you're getting on and which uh, airlines. So let's start by booking a flight, as we said in the beginning of this tutorial. So the trip type is going to be a return stripe, which means we are going and coming back. There is this one uh, trip type. This means you're going uh, and not coming back for the trip. And there is the multi-city. Of course, you can choose a lot of uh, up to five cities. So you're going from city A to B to B from B to C and etc. So for me, I'm just going to choose the return trip. And so we are going from, as an example, uh, let's say here Vancouver to Atlanta. Why not? So departure dates, I'm just going to choose like the last day of this month, the return dates, the last day of uh, the next month. So guess or how many passengers, there is adult, children, infants. So choose all the things that you want for me. I'm just going to choose one guess and get the flights and let's see the flights possible on those two places. So here, let's just wait for the flights until they show for us. So as you can see here, we have a lot of flights here that we can choose from. We can even change the days example for best, better prices, but it seems like this is the best price on that day. So you can choose like the economy or the premium. If you click on economy, as you can see, we have here three plans, the basic, eco, and eco, econo, and econoflex. So each one of them comes with its own features. So for the basic, no changes or cancellation, see selection for a higher fee and check backs for a fee and no WizJet rewards enters. For the Econo, you will be able to cancel or change for a credits and fee, advanced seat selection for a fee, and check back for a fee, and WizJet rewards earn, it's check. So that means it's included. For the Econoflex, of course, you'll have to pay more, but there is cancel or change fee or change sorry for credits and no fee, uh, free sender seat selection, and one free checked bag and with jets rewards. And this is for the economy. You can even get the premium. As you can see, for the premium, we have premium and premium flex. If you get the premium flex, as you can see, you kind of you have everything possible for you want. Whatever you want, you will be able to get it. But you will simply get like uh, this cancel or change uh, for credits and fee will not be like completely on so as you can see cancel or change for uh, credits and fee but for the premium flex the refund for cancel and change for no fee so you will not have to pay anything for refund or even cancel but of course you will have to pay more for the plane so for me i'm just going to choose like economy and i'm coming with basic so continue with basic of course i'll have to check this so continue with basic this is for the department or for the port now we'll have to choose the return and here I'm going with the economy again and basic from here. 
once I do so of course as you can see this flight will take normally four hours so here you'll have to review your flights if you choose like the correct dates depending on whatever suits you as you can see so where it's gonna start where you can go into get in there so the hours non-stop as you can see and that's it so now I'm just going to click on continue and here you can simply sign in into your account or create an account uh, as I said, if you're traveling or creating your account will benefit you the most, so make sure to do so. And for me, I'm just going to click here and continue as a guest. And uh, yeah, so from here, you'll have to enter your details if you continue as a guest. So as you can see, you'll have to simply enter your first name, uh, middle name as you can see, last name, date of birth, gender, uh, loyalty program, this is just optional, Canadian travel number, red, uh, just optional also, readers number optional, and simply, you can simply go, once you fill all of those, click on continue to save selection. From there, you'll be able to select your seats, and on the basic, of course, you'll have to pay if you want to select your seats, or you can uh, just let them select the seats for you uh, once you check in. So you can do that if you have just the basic plan. And then you'll be taken to uh, another place if you want to add anything else, as example, for bags or something like that, you'll have to pay more because we choose like the basic plan. Of course, if you choose a better plan, you may not have to pay anything. And that's going to be basically it. Then you'll be proceeded to give or get your payment. Of course, make sure that review everything, review your personal details, your plane dates and tickets and prices and everything before make your payments. And if you go up, as you can see, you'll find even the total here. So as you can see, 320 uh, point, uh, 87 uh, Canadian dollars so that's gonna be the total you'll have to pay it and after do uh, doing so you will receive like a confirmation email uh, that your plane tickets has been uh, uh, approved and everything and of course you will have to even do the check-in then you'll be able to do it and the websites here as example just go to the home screen as you can see you'll be able to do the check-in here if you don't want to do it in the airport this is a lot of people don't know about this so a lot of people can, can check in on the website without going to the airport and wasting a lot of time there because uh, everyone goes and check in there uh, which will waste a lot of time so basically there you are you check in here you get your tickets and you can go to the airport and travel safely so if you reach this point of this video congratulations you've successfully booked your with uh, just plane tickets online and your travel planes are no set. So with Jets users friendly websites makes your booking process seamlessly and convenient. So if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe for our channel for more helpful tutorial like this one. And of course, I'll see you in the next video.